Welcome, welcome everyone. This is Richard talking to you. I would like to apologize first of all for my poor English. Um, this video is done especially for SK Bismarck and other sub player. Um, the main reason is there was some kind of hot discussion saying that SS can get away or have hard time dealing with ships firing hedgehog at close distance. Well, the point is you can actually get away from close distance when a ship fire hedgehog near to you. So let's begin the test. In this video, you will clearly see that subs can die, critical die faster than hedgehog hitting the water and detonating itself. Now the reason why I'm making this video again is separated laboratory test wasn't enough to convince SKB Smart. So I made this video again to convince him. So here are the values. An hedgehog hitting the water and detonating itself will take three frame three seconds and one frames out of thirty, which means three seconds and thirty milliseconds. Now, the fact is a submarine can critical dive within 2 seconds and 17 frames out of 30, meaning 2 seconds and 550, I'm sorry, 2 seconds and 560 milliseconds, which means that a submarine can die, critical dive faster than a hedgehog hitting the water and taking the time to blow and harm the, the, harm the sub. Now, according to humanbenchmark.com, a human reaction by clicking in average is 215 milliseconds, which means that you nearly have twice the time necessary to click on the critical dive button or simply press the I button and you still can get away from the hedgehog hitting the water. Now, in the video, I have done several tests on several submarines from different nations and different tier submarines. Um, if I recall correctly, I have done tests with the U-Flag submarine, um, Sirene submarine, and Le Redoutable submarine, and I think I have done a British SS-4 submarine critical dive test. Now, you would in every test, you have seen that my tests were done at point blanking. So, in fact, I don't see a reason why it is so hard to avoid hedgehogs fired at close distances. I have added some special features in case that some people do not have tools or software necessarily to check by yourself. So in this video, I have also zoomed in at some part and slow motion the video rate. So you can clearly see that I have clicked right after the hedgehog have hit the water. As a result, you can clearly see that even at point blank, zero degree, since I have asked to be shot at zero degrees, you can still clearly get away from it. Adding the fact that hedgehogs are ranged anti-submarine weapons, which means that you will usually get targeted at a further distance than the distance you can see in the video at point blanking, which means that you have even more times to react and to critical dives and safely get away. Now I have to apologize for what I'm saying since it does sounds rude. Therefore, I would apologize and hope there will be no problem between us. And to be honest, I am not a submarine player addicted. I am an addicted heavy cruiser player. Therefore, when a submarine player addicted tells me that it is near impossible, impossible, etc. to avoid hedgehog when firing at close distance while a CA player is able to do 
that at point blank I feel it is somehow exaggerated that you guys say that it is impossible to get away in fact that if I am able to do the same you guys will be able to do the same either now of course if you get distracted didn't pay attention didn't have a good day have a slow reaction because you didn't eat well you didn't sleep well enough those those are the factors that may affect your gameplay in a submarine drastically now obviously it is the player responsibility that control his ship such as any AA ship that happens to TK have friendly planes or a BB that happens to TK because another ship happens to cross him it is his responsibility to check his ship before firing it such as a submarine player will be careful enough to put his hand on the I button or the critical die button. So this video ends here for today. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video and hopefully people will get more clarification on submarine and hedgehog. Cette vidéo a été dédiée pour la plupart des joueurs de NFN1, d'où la raison pour laquelle j'ai interprété cette vidéo en anglais. Pour savoir davantage, veuillez me contacter et je me ferai un plaisir de vous expliquer davantage. Merci de votre patience et de votre écoute.